Establishing a strong relationship with an exotic veterinarian is vital for ensuring the health and well-being of your reptile companion. Routine annual or semi-annual checkups are recommended to monitor your reptile's overall health and catch any potential issues early. Let's discuss why this is so important and what might occur during an exam. Hi everyone and welcome to Serpente Sunday. I'm Lori with Behavior Education at Spirit Keeper Animal Sanctuary. This is a general informational video about veterinary care for reptiles. One of the most critical steps in caring for your snake or other reptile is establishing a relationship with an exotic veterinarian. These specialists understand the unique needs of reptiles and can provide individualized care that's essential for their well-being. Our reptile veterinarian is Dr. Liza Pfaff. She is a fear-free certified veterinarian at a fear-free certified practice and a member of ARAV, the Association of Reptile and Amphibian Veterinarians. Both fear-free and ARAV have search functions on their websites to help you locate veterinarians in your area. If you can't find a vet locally within a reasonable driving distance with these qualifications, I drive 90 minutes one way to our vet, for example, it is perfectly fine to ask any veterinarian that's close to you if they see snakes or other reptiles, what their experience with them is, if they or any of their staff are fear-free certified, or if they practice low-stress handling techniques. You can ask what the exam will entail and if you will be able to hold your animal or at least be present during the exam. Ask any questions you have about specific diagnostics you may want and let them know your expectations up front. This way, before you even book an appointment, you and they have an idea of each other's expectations and have established clear communication. Routine annual or semi-annual checkups are highly recommended. Why? Because while reptiles don't require vaccinations like other pets, these checkups ensure that your snake or other reptile is in optimal health free from diseases, parasites, and any underlying issues like bacterial, fungal, or viral infections, or diseases like cancer. These routine visits are initial intake exams, and then after that, preventative health checkups for your reptile companions. During the checkup, your veterinarian may start by performing a physical examination. This involves checking your reptile's body condition, skin, eyes, mouth, and respiratory system for any abnormalities. They will also assess weight, which is crucial for monitoring overall health. Sudden weight loss or gain can be a sign of illness or disease. And in addition to that, you wanna make sure you're maintaining your snake or other reptile at an optimal weight, not too fat or not too thin. Vet may also wanna screen for parasites. Parasitic infections can be common in reptiles and can cause a range of health problems if left untreated. This includes endoparasites or those that are internal to your snake or ectoparasites, those that are found on the snake's skin. Early detection through screening is key to effective treatment. And this is usually done by obtaining a fecal sample or a skin scraping and doing a laboratory analysis on it. Routine viral and other preventative screening can also be completed upon your request or if for some reason your veterinarian recommends it and thinks it's necessary. Depending on the species of snake you have or other reptile, they might screen for things like chlamydia, cryptosporidium, furlivirus, reptorinavirus, or inclusion body disease, and serpentovirus, which is also known as nidovirus. While things like cryptosporidium would show up in a fecal test, the viral screening is done from samples of saliva and skin cells from inside your snake's mouth. Your veterinarian will then send the samples off to the Zoological Medicine Diagnostic Laboratory at the University of Florida's College of Veterinary Medicine, which is a full-service molecular diagnostic lab. Addressing minor problems is another important aspect of any routine veterinary exam. So as your vet has checked over your snake or other reptile, they've been assessing it for any small wounds, abrasions, or signs of injury that may need attention and that maybe you didn't notice. Shedding or ecdesis is a natural process for reptiles and it's something that your vet is gonna want to discuss with you. Your vet will assess the shedding pattern by asking you questions about your snake's most recent shed and shed history. And then they can offer you advice on how to best support healthy shedding for your snake species or your other reptile in the future. Maintaining proper nutrition is also crucial for reptiles. Your vet may wanna discuss dietary needs with you, as well as feeding practices, and depending on your reptile's species, supplements to ensure your pet is getting all the essential nutrients. Your veterinarian may also ask you if you're providing UVB for your reptile, 
and what your snake or other reptile's general environment and habitat setup is like. If something unusual is found during the initial exam, your vet may recommend additional diagnostic tests. These might include cultures or imaging studies, such as ultrasound or x-rays. These types of tests can help identify underlying health issues and guide appropriate treatment moving forward. If something is determined to be wrong, blood work, or later potentially chemical restraint or anesthesia may be necessary for a complete exam, further diagnostics, or to conduct a procedure or surgery. Your vet will have the expertise to safely administer any sedation or anesthesia using protocols tailored to your reptile's needs. By establishing a relationship with an exotic veterinarian and scheduling routine checkups, you're taking proactive steps to keep your snake or other reptile healthy and happy for years to come. Remember that prevention is always better than treating illness or disease after it has begun to impact your reptile's welfare. Also remember that if you have already established a relationship with an exotic veterinarian and they are already familiar with your animal, if or when an emergency happens, they are likely to be able to get you in sooner than if you are a new patient. Having a regular vet for your snake or other reptile eliminates the need to call veterinarians randomly hoping one can get your snake in when there is a sudden emergency. Well, everybody, thank you once again for spending time learning with me today. I will put resources in the video description. Speaking of resources, if you have a species of snake or other reptile that is not common, there is nothing wrong with taking information about your reptile species to your veterinarian with you because they cannot be expected to know everything there is to know about every species of reptile or every species of snake that's out there. And until next time, Please remember to always be kind and love your animals.